Hey everybody, Big Rick here with Previews World and I'm with Margaret Atwood and Johnny Christmas who are doing this awesome book called Angel Catbird. Margaret, can you tell us a little bit about that? Angel Catbird is part human, part cat and part bird and he got that way as one does through a collision between a cat, a bird himself, a car and a flask of super gene splicer. The latest method. It's the latest method? It's all the rage in science, I've heard. Now, as far as this whole thing goes, I read that there's going to be a lot of cat puns in this book. Um, what about some owl puns or bird puns? Are there some of those as well? We're getting there. <laughs> awesome. Now, with Angel Cat Bird being, this is your first graphic novel, correct? You're known as a novelist. What was your deciding factor to jump from being a novelist to jumping into the comic book arena? Well, I grew up in the comic book arena, and only later did I become a novelist because I started with drawing comics when I was a very, very young person. I had two superheroes at that time. They were flying rabbits. But I was at that time drawing flying cats with wings, so this is probably something out of my subconscious. It is, however, uh, if you're going to tell a story like that, it is the perfect medium for it, but you need to find somebody who can actually draw serious wings and and uh, human anatomy, and that would be Johnny. All right, Johnny. Now, f question for you: w Looking at the art, it has a very um, that like that 1950s, you know, war uh, posterish look. Um, what is your inspiration behind the artwork that you do? Uh, for this, I, I did look at a lot of like early kind of pulp uh, cartooning. And um, and even like you know Charles Schultz peanuts type cartoon and Maxfield Parrish allegorical sort of uh, painterly stuff as well. Cool. Now, as far as like what you're normally inspired by, who are some artists that have inspired you in your career throughout? You know, as you're coming up. Uh, Jaime Hernandez is a big one. Um, uh, Otomo, of course, is, it was huge, and um, uh, Mike Mignola is really big. Yeah. Awesome. Well. That's pretty much it. We appreciate your time, Margaret. Johnny, awesome. And we wish you much success. This book is coming out later this year, so go to your local comic book stores and make sure that they order it for you and get it through previews. Have a good one, guys.